in the novel of Three Kingdoms. Zhao Yun was an excellent and brave general under Liu Bei. Zhao Yun met Liu Bei in Gongsun Zan's camp, and they respected one another. When Zhao Yun's brother passed away, he had to go home for the funeral. Liu Bei said goodbye to him, while shaking his hands. Because Zhao Yun was disappointed with Gong Sun Zan, and liked Liu Bei, he said to Liu Bei, I'll not let virtue get down. It was destiny that they would meet some day later. When the Battle of Guandu was fought between Cao Cao and Yuan Shao, Liu Bei and Zhao Yun met in Yuan Shao's side. Liu Bei was so glad to meet Zhao Yun again. At the time, Liu Bei and his sworn were separated after losing a war. And as the circumstance Liu Bei desperately needed anyone under him. After Cao Cao won the battle, they escaped to Liu Biao. Cao Cao was chasing Liu Bei. And it was a hard life for them there. In the harlish life, Liu Bei was not able to take care of his family. While retreating in a battle, Zhao Yun rescued Liu Bei's wife and son, Liu Bei heir. In the chaos, a staff reported to Liu Bei that Zhao Yun left to Cao Cao's camp. Liu Bei aimed at him with a spear and said, He is not a man who would leave me. So Liu Bei trusted him more and gave him more difficult tasks to handle. One example was to manage Lady Sun, who was Liu Bei's wife and Sun Quan's sister. She was proud of herself, and lived in luxury believing her status with her brother. When Liu Bei led an expedition force into Yi province, she tried to take Liu Shan, who was Liu Bei's son and heir to her homeland. It was Zhao Yun who took him back safely. However after acquiring Yi province, they had different opinions on politics. When Liu Bei took a throne, Zhao Yun was against for the throne. As a consequence, he was not chosen as one of the top-ranked generals. When the new country gave prizes for establishing the nation. However in the book of the official three kingdoms, Zhao Yun was ranked among the five great warriors with others called the five tiger generals. In fact, his contribution to Liu Bei was far greater than Liu Bei's sworn brothers. He did brave things. When situations were getting worse in Liu Bei's camp. After Liu Bei passed away, Zhao Yun participated in Zhejiang's northern expeditions twice. While defected in the Battle of Juding, it was only he that withdrew his army in order whereas others suffered a great loss. He died in 229 and people admired his integrity and bravery.